Good morning, guys. It's Emmanuel once again. And um, this video is about Pi. Sending Pi out of your wallet to send to somebody in case you want to buy an item. Let's say you want to buy an iPhone. Or you want to buy a, a wristwatch, an Apple wristwatch. So the person will say maybe 5 Pi or 10 Pi or 20 Pi. Remember, Pi is any value you attach to it. Okay, so what you're going to do is the person must have sent you their own wallet address. So I'm going to I'm going to send 100 pi in this video. I'm going to send someone 100 pi using this video as an example. Okay. So I, I have gone and copied the person's address. So you will come here. You come to your pi browser. Now, I want to let you know something. Sending and receiving Pi has to do with Pi browser, okay? Mining. Mining and some other activities has to do with the main Pi app itself. But sending and receiving any, anything that has to do with wallet, you are dealing it here on Pi browser, okay? So you go into your Pi browser. When you go into your Pi browser, you, you go to the wallet section here. Yeah? So we'll click on it. Now when you click on it, now when you click on it, you have two option of opening your Pi wallet. You have the option of using phrase, and the phrase is 24 word. Okay, so I'm because I'm doing this video, I'm not going to use phrase, and also using this phrase is always long. So, but on your first one, you can use phrase, the letter you can then activate unlocking with a fingerprint so for the sake of this video i will unlock with fingerprint because who, whoever holds your 24 letter words the person can also have your wallet and the person can transfer by without your consent from your wallet so we are using we are using this uh, uh unlocking with fingerprint so i'll click on it then i will add my fingerprint okay so your wallet will open like this now you see the ones i've transferred and the ones i have received as as well okay so the next thing is for you to go here you go here pay stroke request pay stroke request so you click on it now there are some there are some if you want you can save an address this is somebody's address i've saved before but i'm not sending to this person okay so since you copied since somebody maybe the person have sent you their pi address on on whatsapp so you have already copied it so what you're going to do is you come here manually add wallet Use this to send or request PI from someone who is not in your contact yet. So that is where we are going to click now. So let's do that. So I have clicked here. And the next thing you are going to do is you you, you paste in the person's wallet address. And I've told you I've, I've copied it already from WhatsApp. So I will paste it here. You will type in the box. Then you hold. Then you paste Okay, now I've pasted it. Now, putting this, putting, put, putting this uh, memo messages is optional. If you want to put something here, say transferred from Emmanuel or transferred from anything, if you want, or if you if you don't want, you leave it empty. Then the next thing you are going to do is to put in the number of pi you want to send to the person. I am sending hundred pi, so hundred. Okay, and the fee is 0 0.01 pi. So you must have extra pi. I have 101 there. So then the next thing is what? Send. Okay, so I will click on send. Then, then they will now ask you, you are about to send 100 pi. Do you recognize this pioneer? You notice this address isn't in your wallet. Blah, 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 blah. You said sending. You don't mind. Or you, the next thing you're going to do is what? You hit confirm, okay? So, I will hit confirm now. It 
is sending. Okay, as you can see, transfer succeeded. Please refer to the history page for your full history transaction. So I will close this. And then when you go back, you, when you go back, this is the this is the wallet address I've sent it to. So when you click on it, which I'm not going to do in this video, you can click on it and then screenshot it. When you click on it, you will see the full address of the person you sent it to and, and the time it went and the amount you sent. Screenshot it and give to the person as an evidence that CEO, I have sent you this uh, pie and that is all. And you are done sending. So that is how to send pie to someone. Thank you. Please subscribe. Turn on the bell notification. I will see you on the next one. Bye-bye. I'll leave a thumbs up also.